website. Uh, in this video, we're going to do a quick walkthrough tutorial on how to build camouflage. Um, right now, I'm on the home page, and all of our products are featured on the home page at this time. So, I'm going to scroll down, and I do want to order a quarter zip pullover. Now, in each product page, we have multiple angles of each of the products to give you a better idea of what you're ordering. Sizing information is all here and we can make those selections a little later. At this point we are going to select uh, add camo to this garment and we are going to dive right into it. It takes a second or two to load so be patient. Alright, um, we've got our blank garment. We're going to start out by selecting a background We offer a number of different colors, and we'll probably add a few here and there as we go. Um, the biggest thing, the most exciting part of what we do is the natural backgrounds. This is going to grow. We're working on more backgrounds and, and uh, all the time. So always look here. This is where the new fun stuff happens. I'm in construction during my day job, so we're going to start out with uh, safety green. Um, we're going to, once you select your background, um, we're going to go in and we're going to add elements. Now you can add as many elements as you'd like to your apparel. Uh, three is a good number if that's what you're looking for. If not, you know, two, one, five, ten, doesn't matter. Um, eventually you'll start to lose them though. Um, I'm going to add some red brush to my design. And... Let's see, we're going to go back in. I'm going to add some birch trees. And I think we're going to go in and we're going to add some pine needles to this as well. Oh, that looks good. <clears throat> now, if I want to reorder them, um, I'm going to use these tools over here, or you can delete. Uh, so you're always working on the top layer, no matter what you do. So I'm going to click on the image. And now the last layer that I laid down, the one on top, is the one I'll be working with. So I'm going to send those pine needles down. Um, so now they're behind. I clicked it once. They're behind the birch. But in front of the red brush, I'm going to click it again and send it all the way to the back. Now, I really don't like that birch trees anymore. So I'm going to click the image again. And I'm going to press delete. Yes, I'm going to delete. That's pretty good, but I've changed my mind. I want to go back in and I want to change the background. So you can do that at any point. I click select background and I want to do 102 tree topper. I like that better. So that's going to leave my elements on the image and change, uh, change the background. Now I want to go back in and I think I want to add some weathered limbs to my design. That's what I like. I'm pretty sure. So once I'm done, I'm going to click preview camo design and that's gonna add some shadowing make it look realistic crop out everything else around it that's exactly what I'm looking for so what I'm gonna do is continue to purchase and what this is gonna do is it's gonna take and build the garment send all the information uh, for your piece of apparel into the back end and save it this also takes a second. Excellent. Now is when I'm going to select my sizing. I'm an XL and I'm not that tall so we'll stick with regular and I'm going to add this piece of apparel to my cart. I already built one earlier today. There you go. Now I can proceed to check out. I hope uh, that's helpful. If you have any questions, don't be afraid to email us. We are always available for you. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.